Hello everyone, here is another Octa-Co powered smartphone that's running Android KitKat with 1GB RAM and 8GB internal storage. I am Gogi from Gogi.in and you're watching the review of Elphone G6. Inside the box you'll find this handset, the Elphone G6, battery of 2250mAh capacity, a free screen guard, user manual, data cable, travel charger. Earphone is not included. Here is the handset. The G6 that looks really good. You'll find the instructions on the back on how to remove the back panel. It's plastic body and the back side is with the matte finish. This is the speaker out vent. The L phone logo, 13 megapixel camera, LED flash and this is the fingerprint scanner. There's a metal finishing with red borders surrounding the camera and the fingerprint module. Back panel is black color with matte finish. The sides are greyish black color, a little shiny and blends well with the back cover. And you'll find these textures on the top and the bottom side. There's a mic at the bottom and this is how the top side looks. The build quality and the finishing is very good. The handset is curvier, it gets slimmer towards the edges. The power button is placed on the right side. There is a mic at the bottom. Volume rockers are on the left side. Micro USB port and 3.5mm audio jack is placed on the top. Three touch sensitive buttons. On the top there is LED notification in called speaker, sensors and the front 2 megapixel camera. There is a slightly curved silver layer below the navigation buttons that gives a very good look to the handset. The back cover is made up of good quality plastic. This is a dual sim handset. You can see the dual sim slots. You need a normal sim and a micro sim. There is a micro SD card slot too. This is micro sim and this is the normal sim overlapping. Handset weight is 125 grams with battery. It is 7.68 mm thick. The breadth is 71.13 mm and the length is 143.75 mm. Let's power on. This handset is running Android KitKat. The UI is customized and uh, touch is very smooth and responsive. Navigation buttons, they do light up. Color reproduction is good. This is a 5 inch screen with 1280 by 720 pixels resolution. Viewing angles are okay. You will see the bluish tint from certain angles. Wi Fi Direct, Wi Fi Hotspot, USB, and Bluetooth Ethering are supported. This handset supports 3G. There is clear motion display option, and you can also set up the preferred install location. 1GB is allocated for apps and there is about 5GB for phone storage. Here is the free space for apps and of the 1GB RAM you get around 395 MB free on the first boot. Air gestures are supported. There is built-in GPS and the lock is pretty fast. Hindi language is supported. And G6 also supports off-screen gestures. I'm going to try the swipe up option. I've enabled it. Switching off the phone and swiping up. As you can see, this works. The key highlight about this handset is that it comes with fingerprint scanner. You can register up to three fingerprints. To register, you will need to swipe your finger on the fingerprint scanner on the back side. You will need to do it in the right way. It will take time getting used to it. Once done, you can also use this fingerprint scanner as a security option to unlock this device. Another exciting thing is that the fingerprint scanner can also be used as a fingerprint navigation. You need to enable this and after that you will be able to navigate using the fingerprint scanner. I have loaded my website. One option to scroll is using the touch screen and the other option is to use the fingerprint scanner as you can see. Swipe your finger over the fingerprint scanner and you will be able to scroll. This feature will work with all other applications. This is not just for scrolling, you can also tap the fingerprint scanner to click. I'll tap the fingerprint scanner and it will highlight and load the particular URL. This is a very good option. You can use it to go through your contacts or browse the image gallery. I have connected an OTG pen drive and OTG does work. Here is the phone dialer. Native video calling is supported. Here is the LED notification. Let's check the system information. It's using the MediaTek MT6592 chipset octa-core with Mali 450 MP GPU. It's running Android KitKat 4.4.2 over 5-inch screen with 720p resolution. 
Here are the list of sensors, accelerometer, proximity, light and magnetic. The time is 7.32, battery at 98% and the temperature at 33 degrees. Quadrant benchmark score is 14348, Antutu score is 28228, Vilamo, Metal, 840 multicore 1389 browser 2438 Nina Mark 2 63.1 fps and this handset supports 5 point multi touch This is with an autofocus camera the camera interface is similar to as seen on many other android smartphones HDR option is supported picture size is 13 megapixel that's for the rear camera front camera is 2 megapixel rear camera can shoot videos in full HD resolution I'm going to record this video and this video got recorded in 1080p at 16 frames per second. You can check sample images and videos shot using this handset on my website. After 24 minutes the battery dropped by 12% and the temperature is 34 degrees. For the next test Wi-Fi is on and I'm going to set the brightness to the maximum. I'm going to play a full HD video in a loop. After 21 minutes, the battery dropped by 13% and the temperature is 35 degrees. Let's play some games as Malt 8, set to the highest visual quality. This game got installed on the external storage. The gameplay is pretty smooth. And now let's check out Modern Combat 5. This game also played very well. I played these games for about 18 minutes. The battery dropped by 12% and the temperature is 40 degrees. Elphone G6 is octa-core powered and it's running Android KitKat with 1GB RAM and 8GB internal storage. You can install apps on the external storage and OTG is supported. Build quality and the finishing is very good and this handset also comes with a fingerprint scanner on the backside that can also be used for navigation. The 13 megapixel rear camera quality is very good. You can check the sample images and videos on my website. It's a dual sim handset with 3G support and the battery backup is average. Elphone G6 is currently priced at $142. If you like this video, do hit the like button and don't forget to share.